Five, a Gwinnett County teacher reported missing in late October has now been found dead in Mexico, according to family and friends. Alexandra Morales was a first grade teacher at Benefield Elementary, and tonight police are still trying to figure out what happened to her. Our Paula Sura spoke with Morales' former classmate and the parent of a former student. Alexandra Morales' friend tells me she spoke to her not too long ago and the 24-year-old told her she was looking forward to visiting her family in Mexico and going to a concert. Her friend says she was last seen at that concert on October 30th and was then found dead just yesterday. Never would have thought she was going to be dead. You don't, you don't expect that. Before Morales' body was found, Jessica Otero shared these missing posters for a week and a half, wondering where her former classmate had gone. The concert she was going to? She had been posting about it, but I didn't know anything about um, why, why she would. It's just, I don't know. I'm still like in shock. You know, it's sad. Morales was a first grade teacher at Benefield Elementary School. He's a little upset. I'm sorry. Destiny Porter's son, nine year old Greg, was one of her former students. And she was nice and kind and she would bring us surprises. She would bring us candy or snacks. In a letter sent to parents Tuesday, the principal said Morales had taken planned personal leave but did not come back last week as scheduled. She added that police are investigating her disappearance from her last known location in Guadalajara, Mexico. It's never easy finding out, you know, somebody in your school community that has passed away, especially if they um, were a part of your children's lives. I don't think it's really said and yet they haven't known for very long. Those who knew Morales say they will remember her kindness and patience. And while she did not have kids herself, they say she loved her students as if they were her own. I was very, very shy. I didn't know anybody. And she was the first one to say, hi, how are you? Super sweet girl. The district tells 11 Alive the school is caring for its teachers and students who are grieving. We've reached out to the Mexican consulate and police in Guadalajara for more information, but have not heard back yet. We'll keep you updated on air and on 11alive.com.